Hi, I'm Doug Jackson and that's SV Seeker, sailing vessel seeker, and we've got to get that boat 16 miles as the crow flies to the Tulsa Port of Catoosa. And to do that, we've got to take that pilot house off, so this is about doing that. Okay, we're going to be welding some brackets onto the trailer because it's a beautiful day and it's not rainy. So when we're done building that, we're going to have a crane pick that aluminum structure up and set it down on this trailer. So that's what the brackets are for. And no, we're not going to use the remaining crane I have because you know, while I might be able to rig it to get it up off the boat, I certainly can't rig it to get it out over this trailer. So that's where Paul Nosack and his crane come in. He'll do that for us. One, two, three. Beautiful. Oh, lovely. We hit you with a chain, didn't we? I don't know. It was just something hard and metal. You, you've forgotten. Yeah. You got a concussion now. <laughs> Two, three. Look at that. Ribbon on. There it goes. Look at that again. Well, we, which by I Hello. really mean uh, Rory here did all the welding pretty much on that. So if it falls off, we blame you. Me. That's right. So, and when it rides on there, you can see this is the base of it where those pipes are. So it's going to stand up almost as tall as the boat is. And we even put a little mount on here to uh, take the crane so we can bolt it on there as well. If we don't put it in the back of my little Toyota pickup truck, that is. It's a little bit big for my truck, I think. So that's it. I think it looks cool. Oh, the plan is to uh, I take the pilot house, set it down here, and then we'll take these plates and we'll bolt these to the pilot house because the pilot house has holes in the bottom of the wall there that bolt it down to the eye angle iron inside the boat. And then the plates will sit on top of these pipes or beside them because the bottom walls of that pilot house curve, you know, they have the curvature of the deck in them, the, both the forward and the aft one does. So when we get those plates sitting here, we'll just weld the plate onto the pipe and that's how she'll take the trip. And then when we get to the port, we'll just take the bolts out. Off comes the pilot house. So now when the Tulsa Port of Catoosa guys, Watco Industries come out here, they run the cranes for the port. They'll tear and come out and take a look at the boat and this thing. They'll decide whether the pilot house goes on to, back onto the boat after the boat's in the water or before the boat goes in the water. I don't care. And look, all my steel is pretty much gone. So we're gonna spend the rest of the day cleaning this up. So that's it for us. What'd you make today? Get out there, make something.
Thank you there. There's a stretch of ground that hadn't seen the light of day in 13 years when we bought the steel. Hallelujah.